Hello everyone, welcome, Dimmy King D here, welcome back to One Shot. Uh, Nico was just talking about how dark and got and light bulb wasn't even lighting up. After looking it up, I need to go find the computer. Because after you do the power, the computer will operate and then you gotta, I guess, get the code for that safe from the computer. You've made progress in the world, Terry. But that progress stops here. I believe you need a code to unlock a certain box. Well, the code no longer exists in this world. Do you understand what this means? Does that pop up for you guys? Oh, no, that box doesn't pop up. Good, start looking. Coaxing within a document. The document has found a place that belongs outside the game. Do you know where to find... No, I don't. Don't you know there's a designated area for documents on your own machine? Some god you are. Look in the documents folder on your computer. I don't think I could have made it any more clear. Alright, so. Documents. Documents that one shot. Holy shit, that's unreadable. Message to you and I'm afraid I must make it brief. I have left you a journal, part of which is written in a language that... In it... I'm going to smash this. Says, Read it and you will know what to do. I have also... Oh, wait. Kind of make dear, yeah, some random letters here and there. And I've also left you a, a mask because you look for metal safe in the quarry to the east, somewhere in between the ocean and the out lookout point. Nine five zero two two three. All right, so nine five zero two two three. No, 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 this is wrong, this is wrong. Back over here. Fuck, ah, ah. Nine, five, zero, two, two, three? Oh, did I close it? Whoops, I closed it. Yeah, nine, five, zero, two, two, three. Whoa, it worked! Wait, how'd you know the code, Terry? I still don't remember seeing one. I had some help. Really? From who? Don't worry about it. Okay. What's in the safe, Nico? Oh, right, let's see. Uh, I found a gas mask. Also, there's this weird looking book. I can't read it, though. Not that I can't read anything, because I can. I just know what language this is. Aww. What? What? What is that? Uh, can I talk to it? I'll wear it when I have to. Uh, we'll just go to the closer gas area. I don't like that. Nothing's ominous. It's very threatening. I should be fine with this mask on. Check the left side first. Seems like another factory area. There's something weird about the robots who get, who get sent to work near the gas fields. They appear to accumulate rust at a much lower rate than the others. The few who work directly with gas to harvesting look practically new. Is that a result of the atmosphere or am I just seeing things? Okay, that's transition area. Wait. That's not a gas area. Also, there's new music here, which is interesting. Hello, do you need any help? I'm good, thanks. Alright, before I go too far off this way, I'm gonna... Go back and check the factory.
Hello person, welcome to the old chemical processing plant. Most of the equipment has already been re re has already been relocated. Spare rubber gloves. They're a bit heavy. Designed to prevent chemical damage. Okay. This seems to be a page ripped out of a book. Cannot overstate the importance of cleaning solvents in this environment. Here's a simple recipe using an alter alternative method discussed in the last chapter, utiliz utilizing the natural properties of blue phosphor. Reagents, acidic gas, blue phosphor, rare form. Instructions, then a well-ventilated area. Direct the gas into your container of choice. Seal immediately. That's into the page. The alcohol bottle. Come here, come here, come here. The assembly and repair services have been discontinued at the Barons. If you have further inquiry, please contact the lead engineer. Ooh, actually. I'll board up. Oh, I should be able to. Yes. Good thing I have this crowbar. What a workout. So, what are they doing down here? When you blow robots without power, I guess Jenner can only do so much. That makes sense, actually. See a page ripped out of a book. Without breaking the seal, inject the liquid phosphor into the container. Ah, uh, okay. Shake vigorously, vigorously to initiate the reaction. Use this as soon as possible. If elements begin to separate, further shaking is required. Also note, hand protection is critical after this step. The resulting acid is moderately stronger than common household cleaners. I don't know what half of these words mean. It's a good thing you're here, Terry. Eh, good point. Cleaning is upon you with a rough surface. I'm on, oh, it's probably for the robot I have to go help. I'm gonna have to figure out this solvent thing. And go pour it on him. Give him a bath. A robo bath. So yeah, good thing I came back, because that was pretty much what I had to do, it looks like. Oh, let's head down. Okay, so... You're big. Oh, hello. What are you doing here? Hmm? A living person such as yourself should have evacuated this place long ago. Oh, but I just got here. To this world, I mean. See, I have the sun. Oh, the Messiah. I don't know what to say. do not know what to say. Greeting you was not part of my programming. Have you spoken to ProfitBot? I think so, yeah. ProfitBot was built with the sole purpose of greeting you. Really? Yes, you cannot speak with anyone else. At least not with ease. Oh, that's kind of sad. What are you built for, then? My purpose is to guard the settlement. Even though the residents have long gone, I must remain. Ah, why though? I have not been tamed. Tamed. It was not worth the effort. What does tamed mean? Unit RM2883417 reporting for duty. I saw that you spoke with the guardian of the settlement. I will now escort you into the. until you reach your dormitory. Um, what? Just, he does just follow me, huh? Kinda. He, he's kinda bad about it. Looks like they're vacuuming the few teamed robots we have here. Makes sense. No point in keeping them all in the barren if all the people are already gone. I wonder if the engineer is going to. Apparently phase one of the evacuation ended prematurely. The big ship started malfunctioning only after a few round trips. They said it was due to something with squares? I'm not sure what they might mean by that. Bummer. Looks like they won't be able to transport most of these surplus robot surplus boss to the city at this rate, and we work so hard on those. But I suppose the robots are busy enough with transporting people as is. I think it's going to be our turn soon. Power cell, I think. Uh, the garden of residential area. I'm scared of ladders. Alright, so we can't go up the ladder, it looks like. Yeah, you can't go up it. He's doing his best. All these terminals do not boot. I am not sure what to do now. Checking, checking. Terminal does not respond. This is a problem. Likely do some sort of electrical and magnetic interference. Hold on. Ooh. Sorry guys. 
I'm afraid this operation can no longer be sustained if the servers continue to fail so much that maintenance cannot keep up with the pace. Fortunately, it does not seem to be happening to the robots. At least not at a significant rate, time will tell. Okay, so we got another building here. Pretty sure robot. You know, I've never been around so many robots before, Terry. Or any robots at all. I mean, I see them in cartoons and stuff, but I've never seen one in person. They're pretty neat, don't you think? Yeah. Okay, that's a ladder. Uh Hello. Hi. What are you doing up there? I am stationed here. By yourself? Yes. Okay. Seems like a lonely life, buddy. Good luck, though. Infirmary. Oh, what? I remember being taught in school about how the waters surrounding the forest stretched until the boundaries of space, but at some point the prehistoric oceans receded, forming what is now the Barrens. I wonder where all that water went. Mm, nope, it went up here. Okay, so this is back at the beginning of the area. infirmary now. No, wait, you come here. Hello, organic person who is alive. The infirmary is up ahead. Oh, thank you. Hello, person with organic makeup. Welcome to the infirmary. Scanning for injuries. Um, scan complete. Injuries detected. None. Treatment required. None. You're good to go. Er, thanks? Box medicals. Most of them broken and rusted beyond use, but this plastic syringe seems to be okay. Hello, person. Are you seeking admission into the infirmary? No? Oh, carry on then. Weird seeing robots have to stick to their post after the end of the world. Kinda sad. Hey, wait, you're not following me. You're that. Oh, you are that robot. Oh, fuck. I like, leave you on and I'll ask for you to reach the dormitory. Are you guys not supposed to go in a building? Correct. We are built for outdoors use only. Entering buildings is not part of, my, of our programming. That's strange. That is strange, actually. Can't go drawing. Oh, he doesn't look at it. Okay. Evacuation at such short notice? I can't believe this. First Sunday, now I'm out of a job. Damn. No one up here either. Okay. Um. There's nothing really much down, is there? So. If I'm looking at thinking of this correctly. Oh, no, I'm not. I was gonna say this should be like the above part of the map, but it's not. Or, unless the map's small enough. In which case, yeah, could be. The vent is on the ground. All the others are taller than me. Initially, the amount of noxious fumes emitted by the natural gas vents caught all, our team off guard. Thank goodness the medical team reacted as quickly as they did. Despite its failure, that first expedition did bring up some interesting observation about the barons. We found that there's not one, but two such vent zones. These fumes are being pumped out at such high concentrations that it seems a miracle that the gas hasn't spread anywhere else. Our biologists concluded that the phosphorus shrimp in the crater pools were actively consuming the gas. The shrimp in the ocean also prevent the gas from wafting off into the glen. If that's the case, then we owe a lot to these little guys. That's right, thank you, shrimp. No, I don't want to smash the bottle. I guess you want to fill the bottle with this gas here? I don't know how to do it.
Hmm. Not quite sure that's what I was supposed to do or not. It's a gas vent. It is taller than you. Holy crap. It looks different. The water looks like jelly formed a bubble over the surface of this pond. So, we're filling up the syringe. I guess it's kind of like a funnel. Liquid might be a bit too thick to fit in the needle. Hey, I actually went in. Gross. Should I eject the, the, the cork? It looks, it's like I'm a doctor. <clears throat> oh, I should probably shake this too. It changed colors. Okay, we have a bottle of acid now. Sky's dark, that it is. Do you know when the sun will be back up? We're working on it. Interesting way to make acid, at least. Alright, so places us right next right near robot. In case you want me to pour this bunch, you think I have these gloves. I hope this works. Alright, hold still. I have no other choice. You got a point, smartass. There. How's that? I can move again. Thank you. I am able to fulfill my purpose again. Where would you like to go? Can you take me to the tower? Calculating. Closest destination tower is the Glen Port number. My built in navigation circuits have fried. I'm. Oh crap, I didn't think it'd go past. It's not good at all. Once again, I cannot fulfill my programming. Aw, is there anything I can do to help? In the event of an error, you should speak with a head engineer. She will know what to do. I think going down would get me there faster. There we go, I had to get a drink, guys, sorry. Almost to her. <clears throat> All, no, I went past her, damn it. <laughs> Excuse me again, miss. I found a robot who can take me towards the tower, but it's having some troubles, so I told me to talk to you. Alright. What is this? What is the issue? It said something about its navigation circuits being fried. Just navigation circuits? Apparently. Didn't I fix everything else, I think? Hmm. I have something that may help. Robots have the ability to trace materials from their source locations. If you let the robot borrow this, then its backup tracking system should activate. The look of amazement on Nikyo's face is adorable. It's a very pretty necklace. What's it made of? Amber from from the Glen. What's the thing inside the amber? The black clover? That's a common plant in our world. It's also... I'm not sure if I can dare to part with this. The programming says yes, but I still feel conflicted. Never mind. You need to finish your mission more than I need a keepsake. Here. Oh, thank you. Before I go, is there anything I can do in return? Actually, do you know how to play chess? Yeah. Well, sort of. I played it with some older kids before. Then will you play a game with me? I mean, I don't know the rules very well, but I guess it's the least I can do. You're really good at this. Thank you. I was built into it was built into my code. Ah, so what's it like being a robot and all? Talk to other other ropes, and they all say something about programming and code and stuff. You even you did just now. 
It's a little hard to understand sometimes. I know. Most of the robots here are not tamed. Tamed? Watch out. There goes my bishop. Taming is complicated. Oh? How complicated exactly? There goes my other bishop. I can't really explain what tamed robots are, but I'm one of them. All the other all the other tamed robots have been moved to other regions. Exactly where I don't know. Oh. There goes my little horse. Knight. Right. Oh, have you ever been to any other regions? I heard that there's two more. In the past, yes. I saw the data, the coordinates, the memories. I don't know how much of that still holds true. The world may be a very different place now. Because the sun is gone? No. I said this already, didn't I? The sun probably didn't, won't save the world. The decaying started back before the sun went out. The sun's sudden death was just the tipping point, and the things went south re really fast after that. Oh, then there's nothing I can do? Check. W what? When'd your queen get there? The only thing you can do is complete your pilgrimage. In a way, you're only supposed to be a second chance for the people. Just like that. Just like how the barons was only supposed to be a second chance for me. There's no guarantee that things still will work out. But checkmate. All right, guess I've kept you long enough. Thank you for listening. I hope you get home safely. Ah, thank you also. Well, that's sad. Off you go. There's no reason for you to linger in the barrens. So I was looking up. There was something someone said about. I'm so different sideways to do that. That's not important. Okay. Yeah, you can shock yourself, apparently, is what the guide said. <laughs> Nico's face. Ow, I got shocked. I told you not to touch it. Terry made me. Ah, oh, you little crap. You little shit. Don't blame me. I'm achieving a lock shock. So, go back down to the guy, give him a thing, and we should be able to go from there. near the mine's entrance. I would have given you the coordinates, but... I'm sorry, is that right? You let me take a nap somewhere before we go? I'm so tired, I can't even see straight anymore. Uh, was it below us? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was just down, wasn't it? No, the one with the bed's up. Whoops. There we go. I'm a little tired from walking. Is it alright if I take a nap? Yes. Oh, it closes the game. Oh, okay. Well, I guess that's it for this video, guys. <laughs> Thank you all for watching. <laughs> uh, like, comment, subscribe. Dislike, dislike, at least some feedback if you could. And I'll catch you all in the next video. <laughs> Bye.